Now, your exclusive Storm Team forecast from KTVO. Expect more. And a good Friday morning to you, Troy Mullen here. We are live from Kelly's Furniture this morning. Maybe you're crying about your busted bracket this morning, but you're not going to be crying about this weather that we've got for today. It's going to be a great one. Get outside if you can. The weekend looks great too, but we are tracking some rain for next week that I'm going to tell you about. Rain and clouds moved through the heartland yesterday, but that has since pushed on out. We're left with some pretty stable weather across the region this morning, along with some uh, fairly clear skies through much of the area. A few clouds in Kirksville, though, 37 degrees, winds from the west at 6 miles per hour in Ottumwa, also into the 30s, but barely 31 degrees, partly cloudy skies, winds from the south-southwest at 8 miles per hour. We told you yesterday that if it did end up raining where you live, that it wouldn't be very much, and that was the case. We added a very small amount to our totals for the month. We received just over a tenth of an inch at the KTV studios much of southeast Iowa got trace amounts or nothing at all we're still about an inch short of where we should be for rainfall for this month and no chances of adding to those totals today clear skies and you can't get rain if you don't have the clouds and and we won't we're hitting our average temperature by around noon and get out and enjoy the weather because we've got temperatures into the low and mid 60s by later on this afternoon. We'll stay above normal through the weekend. There's a slight dip in temperatures heading into Monday, but by Tuesday we're up close to 60 once more. We can expect lots of sunshine today with temperatures in the low to mid 60s. 64 is a popular number in Ottumwa, in Centerville, in Unionville, 63 for the high today in Memphis. Lots of sun, winds not too bad from the southwest. That will be the case once more tonight. Clear, cool, and comfortable with temperatures in the upper 30s and low 40s all across the region. If you can't spend some time outside today, you've got another chance this weekend. Look at the five-day forecast here and see what we have going on. You're going to love it. We're uh, expecting some mild conditions for Saturday and for Sunday with temperatures into the upper 50s to end the weekend. We do have a chance for some rainfall late Sunday night leading into Monday with partly sunny skies. Temperatures a little bit below normal, near 50 degrees, then back close to 60 on Tuesday. And I'll say it again, maybe a thunderstorm Tuesday night or into Wednesday with that 70% chance of rain and overnight lows in the 30s and into the 40s. Yeah, so go out there and enjoy today and even tomorrow, especially after yesterday. Yesterday mm -hmm. was so dreary. And even Sunday will be great yeah. until later on, okay. around, until around bedtime is when yeah. it'll start to, uh, the rain starts to move in. So Sunday's good right. too. And the grass is starting to pop up all nice and green mm -hmm. in some parts of the heartland. I'm excited. I'm expecting uh, my the guy who mows my yard for 20 bucks to come knocking on the door any day now, say, come on, give me your money. I'll say, all right, so all there right. you go. There there you go. You yeah. heard it here on mm -hmm. Good Morning Heartland. Yeah. I've got a guy though, so you got to be better than him. Well, how about if somebody wants to do it for five bucks? Well, they're hired. <laughs> Sounds good. Yeah. All right, it's now time for some sports. Here's Fred.